If you drive around Greenville, you'll, still, you'll see plenty of restaurants from the chains along Greenville Boulevard to the local staples in uptown Greenville. But there's one you may not have heard about. It's tucked away near ECU. WNCT's Josh Birch headed to Christie's Euro Pump for this week's Down Eats. Just two blocks away from East Carolina University, along Jarvis Street, sits Christie's Euro Pub, serving up what the owners call glorified bar food, but what I'm calling absolutely delicious. It's a dive, but it has really good food. Good food, laid back, friendly. I just remember I like the food and everything, and I want to come back. It doesn't take long to see why people are piling into Christie's Euro Pub, not just for beer, but incredible fresh and local food, like the pulled pork nachos. Flour, tortilla chips, um, lots of pulled pork, and then like sour cream, cheese, tomatoes. The pork's very good, and I like the chips. Um, but it's all together, just really good. Just drop it right on in there like that. From the beer-battered onion rings with the homemade Jalula. dipping sauce. Nice. To this mammoth of a sandwich, fittingly called the Stoner's Delight. That's French toast batter. We just dip this in a um, French toast batter. You start with a hoagie roll, drenched in French toast batter. After spending some time on the flat top, the hoagie meets some sugar. I like the French toast and everything mixed the together. Flavor, the flavor yeah. mixing. So I put a little bit more powdered sugar on there, and that's the Stoner's Delight. It's topped off with three eggs, bacon or sausage, and then of course, a lot of syrup. Mm. This is my personal favorite on the menu. Oh, yeah. But if that doesn't do it for you, how about some fresh catfish raised down the road in Aiden? You get a catfish, we say catfish, they're bringing it up already breaded like this, and our breading is flour and cornmeal, cornmeal and slap. We put it in everything. Slap, of course, Christie's secret seasoning that takes food from good to my goodness, delicious. That's just flaky, too. Even if you fry it, it's still flaky. Fresh every day. And you can taste the fresh ones. Making everything homemade with quality ingredients was one of the big changes when owner Tandy Mon Wilson took over back in 2009. A decision sparked by her then boyfriend and now husband. He said, I don't want to date a bartender. If you're going to be a bartender, you should own the bar. And so I said, challenge accepted. Well, that's an understatement since taking it over, Christie's has taken off. The idea of being off the beaten path to me is kind of exciting. But Christie's is more than just a restaurant. To its employees and regulars, it's known as your living room, but just one that you have to wear pants at. And it's kind of like cheers. Like you go here like after you've had a hard day or whatever, and just to like feel better and just have a good time with good food. The food company and small pub feel leads Christie's in a category of its own. We keep thinking that we are at max capacity for sales and growth and then every month proves us wrong. Eating in Greenville, Josh Birch, nine on your side. Now Christie's brunch and breakfast items are so popular they serve them until 5 p.m. every day. I can see why. The menu recommendations we got there, the pulled pork nachos, Stoner's Delight, and the bison burger sliders. Gotta go there.